I always believe that it's through lived experience that you have that emotional connectivity with another human person and another way of understanding life. So I first met Epic about a year ago when I was at an international conference and Epic was co-hosting the event. The conference was filled with professional sport leaders from Olympic level sport, elite sport, and I just watched the tremendous respect that Epic gained in the relationships they built when I was with this community. What appeals to me about Epic is the lived experience. Uh, many moons ago, about 15 years ago, I finished my PhD and I used lived experience and storytelling as a way to take people's experiences in sport and have it relate to the academic world and others. And I always believe that it's through lived experience that you have that emotional connectivity with another human person and another way of understanding life through people's lenses that may connect to either a feeling, emotion, an experience, a memory, something that you've had or someone that you care about has. Epic has the courage to slow down and say, what is the best way that we can work with the athletes? How can we help them understand the risks involved in gambling, educate them in a preventative way of what gambling means to their world as young athletes with tremendous pressures all around them? And through lived experience also relate to the staff who are trying to do their best to serve in a very, very intense environment in a pressurized way. So what connects to me most is the, the utilization of lived experience because I truly believe that that is the way to connect to the hearts and the minds of the people that need to learn about this. My new role is working in North America and trying to build upon the relationships that they have established within professional sporting organizations. They have a tremendous success right now within the NCAA programming and in the last six to 12 months they've been forming relationships with almost every pro league hopefully by the end of this calendar year we'll connect with all of them and my job is to help Epic understand what the clubs need and want communicate that back into our facilitators and then build out programming that meets the needs of the players and the staff of the organizations that we've now partnered with. The number one thing that is foundational is trust. Those leagues have many people and organizations coming to them, lining up um, endlessly to work with the players and the athletes and the staff. I think that for those organizations to sign on with Epic means that they have a belief that what Epic is doing will have an impact and it's needed. The future holds continuing to have that co-active relationship of design. And that's where I think the next level will be with the MLB starting at spring training in about a week from now, working with the MLS, working with the NFLPA, and then the other relationships that are going to come forward. I would love to see Epic being a, involved in every single professional sports organization on this continent. I'd like every athlete to have the experience of learning through lived experience and also engaging in conversation of what matters to them and what they want Epic to continue to bring to their space. My secondary goal is, is building out the consultancy model. I think by utilizing consultancy as another way to make connection with the clubs and the teams, we can work in an individualized way with them to, to build and grow together that is personal, is customized, is bespoke and very private but meets their needs in a way that is, is elite.